Hey guys, Zoop here, and today I present you with the winners of the Epic Win, Epic Fail contest. Ship Comrade of ShipComrade.com proposed this community event and has been nice enough to pony up a Mermance for the winner. There were numerous entries to choose from, but four of them managed to embody the spirit of the contest. Without further ado, we start with number four, provided by Mad Lunatic. Rocking out with his New Mexico, he shows us the full power of the battleship by deleting not just one or two cruisers, he deletes three cruisers that had decided to convoy broadside. This is while being relentlessly hunted by an enemy destroyer to his stern. Mad Lunatic has some nice Star Wars looking mod going right now, and it looks like he's shooting laser beams. A bit of epic win and epic fail at the same time, Lunatic is unable to fully deal with the destroyer in front of him, which finally takes him out. Still, I think we'd all agree it was totally worth it, and he did a wonderful job erasing a trio of cruisers. Next up we have Mud Murfin playing ranked. Murfin comes up on an enemy destroyer that plants a full salvo of torpedoes in his side. Murfin is able to take out the destroyer though, which in the scheme of things helps his team out because we all know in ranked, the team that wins is the team that stays alive. Limping over to New York with little in the way of his own hit points, Murfin presses the attack. He has angling to his advantage and the New York decides to remain broadside. This allows Murfin to quickly deplete his hit points. Unfortunately, Murfin can't find that elusive citadel with his own ship. With little strength left, Murfin is just able to get one last salvo off before he's destroyed. This finds its mark and he's able to vanquish the New York, winning the round for his team. Pretty good win there. Ascender has a clip in which it's hard to fully grasp the amount of fail he's provided to us. Complete with some nice tunes, this video shows just how badly things can go for both sides. He starts off by completely missing the enemy with a full salvo of torpedoes fired from his Fletcher. The enemy just flat out stopped and likely threw his aim off. What's next is an even more epic fail as the sender pilots his ship within mere feet of the enemy who completely blows his chance to take him out, firing his own torps and missing by mere feet again. The sender safely passes by and makes the enemy pay, taking him out with a relentless barrage of cannon fire. But the epic failings aren't over. As a Benson appears on the horizon and locks a sender in another attack, rounds are exchanged and a sender then makes an epic critical error. He grounds himself. He can only watch helplessly as the Benson's torps close in for the kill. Just a wonderful collection of failure on both sides. Lastly, we have our winner of epic win, epic fail. Extreme X has two ships closing in and he is lying in wait. This is every destroyer's dream, the perfect ambush. He starts his engine up, fires his spread, and the torpedoes close in home, but they're not enough to finish either ship off. To make matters worse, Extreme is trying to flee, but the enemy has its own plans and launches multiple salvos in his direction. They find home and Extreme went from having a chance to be a double strike hero to going home with nothing. But Extreme won't walk away with nothing, he'll get a Mermance to hopefully make sure that the outcome will be different next time. Thanks for the entries guys and thank you Ship Comrade for the prize. Make sure to check out the website at www.shipcomrade.com. I'll have more of these contests in the future. Thanks for watching, Zoop out.